This is uh, I Go Travel with uh, Don Barnett. And a Merry Christmas to you. And uh, I've got some other fellas here who want to say Merry Christmas, and they'll tell you what's in this travelogue. In case you don't understand Froggy, uh, those guys were saying that uh, in this uh, travelogue, uh, we're going to look at a Christmas village, listen to some Christmas music, uh, take a look at some uh, Christmas bears and camping bears, and then we'll uh, go outside and uh, take a look at uh, some of the lights around town that people put out on their front lawns. And uh, partway through this uh, travelogue, uh, there's an extra uh, treat included. I will recite you one of my favorite poems. And that in itself is the worth the price of admission. And then we'll wrap her up. I'll give you some, uh, uh, a good hint or two on how to get the most out of that uh, mistletoe at Christmas time. All right, here we go. Uh, we usually set out a tree and uh, decorations around in different places. Uh, this year we put the Christmas uh, village up uh, along uh, a shelf. A uh, Christmas village is a kind of thing that you don't uh, uh, build in one year. It, uh, you buy another piece one year and another piece the next year and uh, pretty soon you uh, get a, an accumulated uh, number of uh, village uh, pieces. Bears are a very popular uh, ornamental uh, decoration, and we've got some uh, with the Christmas theme and the camping uh, theme. A lot of people put up a Christmas tree at uh, Christmas time and they decorate it. And uh, we're no exception. I'll show you a few of the decorations uh, that hang uh, from our tree. Thank you. 
Uh, just before we go outside and uh, drive around to look at uh, some of the outside uh, Christmas lights, uh, we'll take a break here and uh, I'll uh, recite you uh, a poem that I know. "'Twas the night before Christmas, when all through the house there were empties and butts laid round by some louse. My best crock I'd hid by the chimney with care had been swiped by some bum who had discovered it there. My guests long since had poured in their beds to wake in the morning with awfully big heads. My mouth full of cotton hung down to my lap, for I was dying for one more nightcap. When through the north window there came such a smell, I sprang to my feet to see what the hell. And what should my wondering eyes show up but eight bloated reindeer hitched to a beer truck with a little old driver who looked like a hick? I saw it was Santa as tight as a tick. Staggering onward, those reindeer came as he hiccuped and belched and called them by name. On Seagram, on Shenley, you two black and white, get off this wall, get up on the roof, we ain't got all night. Then up on the rooftop went reindeer and truck, but a tree branch hit Santa before he could duck. And then I heard from a cooing above, that was some terrible words, that was no cooing dove. So I pulled in my head, then I caught the sharp ear. Down the chimney he plunged, landing smack on his rear. He was dressed up in furs, no cuffs on his pants, and the way the guy squirmed, well, I guess he had ants. He spoke not a word, but went right to his work, missed half the stockings, the plastered old jerk. And then, putting five fingers to the end of his nose, he gave me the bird, up the chimney he rose. He dashed for his sleigh at so hasty a pace that he tripped on the cable and slid on his face. But I heard him burp back as he passed out of sight. Merry Christmas, you rum-dums, now really get tight.
We'll show you a couple more uh, uh, Christmas decoration uh, displays, and then we'll uh, get into that thing where I show you how to handle that the mistletoe properly. Okay, you've uh, all heard about the mistletoe uh, tradition. Uh, you know, if you uh, catch uh, somebody under the mistletoe, uh, it's worth a kiss. So uh, I can give you a couple of suggestions there. I found in my experience, uh, uh, speed and surprise is the answer. So here, I like, I don't wait to get find a mistletoe to get under. I carry my own and I just slip it on the top of my head here and uh, I'm ready. And uh, so what you do is you, you uh, come up to the loved one and uh, you get ready. Are you ready, dear? Here we go. Well, there you are. I always like to end up on a positive note. So, uh, Merry Christmas, uh, mes amis. Uh, uh, Merry Christmas, y'all. We'll see you down, down the road and all the best in the new year.